both started 34 years ago to not only raise money for the schools, which is the primary function, but also to uh, give notoriety to the mountain players the, that in the past haven't had the opportunity to have the media coverage and the recognition by playing out, out of town teams in some of the larger football schools in the state. By the time uh, football season rolls around, I think anyone that's a football fan is excited and ready to go and to have this as uh, one of the earliest events and the second oldest bowl in the state. It always brings a lot of attention to it and a lot of uh, turnout. So uh, we look forward to that and to seeing, as you said, uh, some really strong competition from other places come in and see how uh, our kids stack up. There's a lot that goes into the planning of it. Uh, you have to work with the uh, facilities to make sure all that is in place and getting the teams themselves. Uh, you, you wouldn't uh, think that it would be as difficult as it is to, to match up schedules, but sometimes that's a challenge as well. I just give a lot of credit to all the folks on the committee. Everyone serves different functions and does different things. And then our marketing staff at the bank works very hard throughout the year on it as well. So uh, it's a group effort, but uh, one that you know, is enjoyable and it pays off. I think that uh, that has been successful because we've had great coaches. We've had uh, great competition come from other places. And I give credit to the media. This news conference itself, looking at the number of media uh, members that were here today versus maybe 10 years ago has grown tremendously and you can't promote anything without help. So we, we certainly thank everyone and like I said, it's a group effort.